And a warm welcome. This is the scene here at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City up against Crystal Palace. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Well, it's difficult to be full of confidence when you're trying to pose problems for this Manchester City defence. Statistically, the best in the league, Stuart. Well, they've been so solid at the back, whether it's in front of their own fans or away from home. I think it comes down to communication. They're just so well drilled and organised. Hopefully for the neutrals, they do concede the first one today. Good game. Have a great game. Thanks. Good game. Thanks. Cheers. Good luck. Good luck. Cheers. Game out there. Good luck. Cheers. Thanks. Good game. Good game. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Well, this is the team Crystal Palace have picked. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. And the game begins. City pushing forward with options available. And it took a touch on the way through, so a corner here. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, a bit short with the clearance. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. Kuyate. Well, he's given it away. Couldn't keep it. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Can they nudge in front? Emerson and goal made it look easy. It is to be a throw in. Crossing opportunity. Venteke. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, they've lost the ball. Gallagher. And Crystal Palace moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Oh, a lovely ball. He's in position. That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. So the corner played into the box. A decent effort, but the keeper read it all the way. Applying vigorous pressure. Bernardo Silva racing forward trying to catch them out well it looked highly promising but it came to nothing in the end James MacArthur Kuyate now MacArthur possession one
read it well. Gallagher. Now Christian Benteke. Untidy on the ball. Silva. Now let's see what they can do here. Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Rodri. De Bruyne now. De Bruyne. The ball with Rodri. Grealish. Rodri. Set pieces can be so important. Let's see what City have been working on. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Going short. And Bernardo Silva has it. Well, a poor effort from a difficult angle, Stuart. Well, he took the wrong decision there. He surely had to cut that back. Kuyate. Gallagher. Ocarto now. At times they make passing look easy. Macarthur, and he takes it away. Now can they counter clinically? They need to get bodies back. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. And he's fired over the corner. It hasn't come to very much. Bernardo Silva. Rodri. Now oh, that's a well-timed pass. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Oh, he squandered the chance. And he knows it. Well, it wouldn't have counted anyway. He was offside. But nonetheless, that was a poor attempt. Well, as you can see, City have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes and have played some really lovely football going forward. But they must now make it count and get themselves in front. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Bernardo Silva. And Torres on the ball. Really vital interception. Mitchell. Disappointing for Palace to give it away in that fashion. Ferran Torres. Silva. Now a decent position. Might jump in front. Kevin De Bruyne with the goal. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly, and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Are back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. An unforced error, you've got to say.
Ferran Torres. And that will be all for the first half as the referee blows his whistle and it's Manchester City on top. So, the ball rolling again. Palace trailing after the first half. Can they come up with a response here in the second? Gallagher. Kuyase now. Gallagher. Kuyase. Now Christian Benteke. And he's got the beating of his opponent. Kuyase now. And dispossessed. Into the advanced position. Oh, he's really opened them up here. And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, as you can see, it was a fairly simple finish in the end, but you still have to be in the right place, keep your composure and finish it off, and that's exactly what he did. So, 2-0 now. Number 10, Jack Anderson. Kuyase now. Are you... Failed to keep hold of it. Space afforded him. Options in the centre. He got nothing but ball. He's conceded the corner. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch. And Manchester City will go to their bench. To be replaced by number five, John Stones. Well, opting for the short corner. And Bernardo Silva has it. Now with Silva. Rodri. Bernardo Silva. Oh, could be. And a goal! They're running riot here. Almost out of sight. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. So the action continues and City really cantering to victory here. Wilfred Zaha. Well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good oh, team. Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score! The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. And taking it away. Are you? Could be troublesome. The ball with Jordan, are you? How about the cross? Connor Gallagher. And there to intervene. And there might well be scope for them to counter attack here. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? It's there for him. Terrific piece of anticipation. But he took care of it defensively. 
20 minutes remaining. Ayew. And players waiting in the centre. And behind it's gone for a corner. Substitution for Manchester City. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Simple for the keeper. Said he could be onto something. A oh, terrific pass. We wondered who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. Well, as we get close to hearing the final whistle, Manchester City dominant. Manchester City excellent. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. Alert defending. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And he's made headway. Surely. Ronaldo Silva. And blocked for now. A fine reading of the situation. Playing with purpose and control. He might yet finish. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. There's plenty of know-how. Great opportunity. And he hits it well. But off the post. Goal kick it'll be. Substitution for Crystal Palace. Substitution time it is here. Joao Cancelo. And room now out on the wing. Crossing opportunity. Bernardo Silva. And just narrowly wide. Well, it's a good effort from that range, but I think the keeper had it covered. Number 15, Jeffrey Shaw. Anderson. MacArthur now. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Kuyate. Milivojevic. Went in strongly, decisively. Gundogan. And that pass could be troublesome. He just needs to keep a cool head. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. And there's the final whistle. It goes into the books as a City victory. Well, they've been great defensively, as we know, but it was all about their front players today. Their movement, awareness of space, and speed of thought was just too much for their opponents. They could have won this by a lot more. They need to get...